All right, Mickey, I just got your video. Uh, I ordered some Thai food, and I thought I would do this kind of, you know, good old TS style, kind of raw and spontaneous kind of thing, you know, direct response kind of thing. So let's see what you got to say. I thought I'd do a really serious video. I thought I'd um, touch <laughs> something serious. Serious? What? What are you gonna do? With something serious? There's nothing serious about you. <laughs> I don't, you know, I, I very rarely touch anything very seriously or very deeply. Oh, <laughs> oh I feel so sad. Really? Oh no. Um, I told you you should go out for some date sometime. You know, you just, I don't know what you got, what you do. At home, I mean, you make a whole bunch of soccer accounts, you troll people, hack out of them. I mean, you know, what the heck? So, in this video, I thought I'd, I'd touch something, you know, very <laughs> serious. Hopefully, I can touch you in a serious way, too, because I want you to be touched seriously. Oh, man, look at this. Already, he's not serious. You know, all these things that he craps out is nothing but serious, man. Okay, and that is the difference between... A fundamentalist and a normal religious person. Wait a minute, I gotta really, really gotta hear this. Fundamental and normal religious person? I, I, I gotta hear this. Start with a normal religious person. A normal religious person is just someone who believes in God and so on. Um, <laughs> they might believe in the Bible or the Quran or whatever else. They don't take it literal. They take it for what it is. They might have their own idea of what it means. But they don't take it to the point of wanting to, I don't know, say, kill. Okay, so like a religious person is just normal. That's what you're saying. Hey, listen, Mickey, do you think God created some religion? Do you think God is religious, man? <laughs> People. Or project their own loathsome inadequacies upon others. The sort of thing where you look what, at... Wait a minute, did you just say kill people? What do you mean kill people? Nobody kill people, man. Whether you are a fundamentalist or whether you are just some religious person, you don't kill people just because you are fundy. Man, this kid is so, how should I say, um, not genuine at all, not frank. Um, man, it's like stinky, <laughs> twisty, nothing but crap. Someone you think, oh my god, he just said that. He really just said that out loud. Well, you gotta give an example. All right, let's say someone said, you know, whatever. Then what is it? What is it that that made you ah? You know, I can't believe someone you said it. What? Some people cannot say certain things. What is that thing, man? Why wasn't he made into an abortion and stuck into a biohazard bin a long time ago? Of course. Well, man, that was not even nice, was it? I mean, you're talking about actually killing people and describing it. You are the one who really wants to kill people, aren't you? Huh? We all wonder that, but that would be really horrible to say something like that about someone. So I would never say or even dare to... You, you just said it, man. What are you talking about? You just said it. <laughs> think something Mickey. like that about anybody. So a regular religious person just believes what they believe. They get on with everyone else. They're not assholes. They just do what they do. There's a few on YouTube. You probably see a few Christians who are regular Christians. So like those people who are not gospeling, you know, gospeling to you, those people who don't really convict you, those people who kind of leave you alone and let you do your thing and kind of laugh at your comedies. And that's what you're talking about. Those kind of people you're talking about, right? Listen, kid, most of the people, uh, Bundies, you want to call it, the reason why they're on YouTube, they're not on YouTube for entertainment like you, okay? <laughs> you, gotta, you, gotta, you gotta think outside of your little own box, okay? We are not here to entertain you. <laughs> so, uh, IG, Meta Gorilla. Um, if you like him or not, he's just a regular Christian. He thinks he's a fundy. He's not a fundy. He's really not. He's off on a... By the way, you got to tell us what fundy is, all right? You just cannot say fundy is someone who wants to kill, all right? No, no it doesn't work that way. What is fundy, all right? And what is not? 
and what is Christian, what is religion. I mean, as you, as much as you are like some movie wear, uh, wearing silly guy, you know, nothing but a joke, but you think that you can decipher or discern certain people are what Christian or fun. I mean, you as an atheist wannabe, <laughs> you know, with some stupid movie mask on, how can you even judge anybody whether he or she is some Christian or not? Road trip with Agent Adele. That's not funny. What? No, what? What? Fundies cannot have road trips. <laughs> what kind of logic is this? What? Fundies cannot have road trips. Man, Agent of Doubt is not a person or people. Maybe you know, Inventor Gorilla was is trying to gospel to him. You know what? Maybe they're just good friends. I mean, who cares? I mean, what the heck? If that doesn't make him funny. I mean, I don't even know what that means anyway. <laughs> what are you talking about, man? Uh, Bruce, um, Red Dog Zombie, yeah. sorry. Uh, he's a regular Christian. Really? He doesn't even know whether you know, Jesus is God. He doesn't even know Jesus you know, resurrected. He doesn't even know, you know, that he died for, uh, for our sins. What the heck, man? <laughs> what the heck? You know, you gotta define yourself but a, what a Christian is in your own tongue. I mean, you, as I said, you as an atheist, right? You don't believe in God. You think there is no God, right? And you have no idea what being a Christian is. And maybe you just had some bad Catholic experience when you're like seven or something. You know, who knows? And th that's all you know about Christianity, right? I mean, what do you know about anything about religion or, or anything to do with God, for that matter? You being in a stupid mask wearing, you know, I'm sorry, stu you know, mask wearing atheist, right? Aren't you? The soil always seems like a regular Christian. <sighs> um, I think Anita, I know she calls herself now, she's a regular Christian. I know she's a, no offense to you, you know. Um, and this is so idiotic. Even the people, even the people who are on his channel, I mean, I can, I'm not going to mention their names or anything. Man, they're so idiotic. So idiotic. I mean, these people, he thinks that the people who are hanging around in his channel think that is some sort of, like, genuine Christian. And he thinks that he can kind of, what, decipher what they are. Yeah, Man. you do go into the conspiracy side of things as well. But you're not a funding, that's the point. A fundy is a whole different kettle of fish. Alright, so I hope he's going to define what it is. They believe themselves to be better than everybody else. And <laughs> <laughs> no, Mickey. No, Mickey. I only think that I am better than you. Alright? And also, fundy, if you mean that, I think you mean like born-again Christians. Okay, genuine born-again Christians. They are the only ones who know the truth, of course. Yeah, of course, man. When you're born again, you're born into the Holy Spirit, and that's the whole truth. And you love nothing but truth. Guess what? You are nothing but fake. I mean, how can I tell? <laughs> Look at your mask, man. Nothing but fake. But anyway, so... You know, genuine born again Christians don't like anything fake. They like everything true, like Jesus Christ. Do you understand that? Probably not. They are comparable to the people in ancient Greece, the uh, or ancient Egypt even. The fucking crazy priest you used to get back in ancient Greece. Wait a minute, is this idiot comparing some Egyptian priest? You know, those people like healing and you know those two fundamental Christians? I mean, this guy is an idiot. Hey, Mickey, give me one case where <laughs> there's some kind of fundamentalist going around killing people. Man, make comparable comparison, man. That's why you're such a Mickey. We believe everyone is going to die because I said so. <laughs> I knew this was coming. Oh, man. Volcano goes off. Mickey, you're so predictable. You know, uh, and expectable. <laughs> Somewhere nearby, <laughs> they would sacrifice a thousand human beings to try and quell the god's thunder or idiot, uh, make the gods happy. That's a fundamentalist. <laughs> this guy's an idiot. He's, so he's equating 
to fundamental Christians to people who kill thousands of people. What the heck? What's in your head, man? Nothing but dumb. <laughs> I mean, just because you wear a mask, you cannot spew out that kind of crap all the time, man. You can get arrested for that, you know? Fucking lunatic. So there is a difference there. There is a big difference. Idiot, man. Um, some people probably don't know this. I didn't know this at first. I thought everyone was just, you know, a Christian. I didn't know some people were, well, took it a little... Well, it, it would have been better if you didn't know at all. <laughs> but the thing is, now you don't even know anything. Actually, you know... You know something, but that something is very wrong. You're comparing fundamental Christians to like all the killers out there. And you think that's true. Because why? Because you got butthurt? Man, just, you're, you're nuts, man. A bit too far, shall we say. Another thing with fundies is that they are essentially people who are in a cult. But they don't know they're in a cult. Like, Okay, I gotta hear this. Okay, I gotta hear this. Most people who are in a cult, they don't know they're in a cult. If you're a fundamentalist, you because are in a cult. You're in your own set of, say, Christianity. You know, look at all these so-called his friends. You know, they always kind of turn their backs around them whenever they can. And they move about. And you, if you observe this atheist community, they stab each other. They backstab each other. And they backbite each other. You know. And here he is being dumped by a lot of people and being buttered by a lot of people and his friends are changing all over the place and here he is crapping on some fundamental Christians as some kind of killers you're in your own set you're not part of the group see that's the thing he speaks of exactly what he is I mean he, he doesn't even know that uh, he actually is in a sect called, um, I don't want to like, uh, you know, point all the fingers to atheists, but, uh, you know, atheists, listen, this guy right here, <laughs> this guy right here is really giving you guys really bad name. This is the dumbest, dumbest ever atheist I have ever seen on YouTube. This guy is, is dumber than, like, uh, uh, DPR Jones or dumber than Aaron <laughs> dumber than anybody <laughs> or the spectrum of Christianity you've cornered yourself off and point fingers at everyone going you're cunt look at that he's the one pointing the fingers to Christians <laughs> he's everything whatever he says is is all about him everything you know like I could I could put my mask on <laughs> and play his video and I can make the response to it and that will be just appropriate every time he whenever he speaks something he's talking about himself <laughs> listen Mickey you are in like a, a cult called Mickey Mouth Clubhouse okay <laughs> yeah yeah well, you're right you know, that's what you are you are almost the same as extremists in Islam uh, the guys who run around with backpacks have See what I'm saying? He's not being able to make any sort of comparable comparisons. And this we can observe from many uneducated people. They just pick up this and that here and there. And they compare that with Islam blowing up all these people to genuine born-again Christians who would die for him. This guy is such an idiot. It's unbelievable. Explosives in them. You are that, but Christianity's version of that, you see. You see, Muslims look at extreme fundamentalists in, in Islam, and they say, they're not Muslims. Those guys aren't Muslims. Those guys are fucking nuts. They, they don't speak for me, you know, and all the rest of it. And I, I agree with them. I think they're right. And when you look at these Christians, it's the same deal. It's exactly the same deal. And I think people are... Listen, those are called extreme Muslims, and... Uh the thing is, they consider themselves Muslims. And those people who are uh, moderate Muslims, they don't want to associate with them, but at the same time, deep inside them, they associate with them and they agree with them. And guess what? They carry out actually the uh, actual killing and blowing themselves up and all that. Have you ever seen any Christians doing that? Have you ever seen what any sort of... Uh, uh, fundamental Christians, as you put it, strapping himself with a bomb and blowing himself. I mean, have you ever seen it? 
Man, this guy. Hey, Mickey. Mickey, if you want to talk. Actually, you don't have mouth broken. If you want to crap out certain things, you got to have certain facts straight and, and be able to make certain uh, comparisons with comparable comparisons. Do you understand? <laughs> In all Christians are the same kind of <laughs> shitty paint. It's not the same. <laughs> you've got regular Christians, you've got regular Muslims, and you've got the oh, extremists. This guy is now, stupid. Now, you don't get extreme Muslims on YouTube. Oh, well, um, probably because, you know, you know, as soon as you put that view out there, the FBI uh, yeah, stick yeah, a deal yeah. up your bum and put you in Guantanamo Bay. But if you're a Christian, you can't do that because no one's really keeping an eye out for it. All that. you have to do, Mickey, is like, what you have to do to prove your uh, opinion or to prove your assertion is that you just give us an example of a Christian strapping himself with bomb and blowing up some kind of bus whatever, killing a whole bunch of Jews or whatever, okay? You gotta give me that. Otherwise, what you crap out is just only crap. It's just a joke, all right? That's why people laugh at you. You see, a lot of fundamental, genuine, born-again Christians are not really like me, all right? They are very nice. So they cannot really speak out uh, saying that you're a joke, all right? But you are a joke. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We don't really speak out, okay? I am the one because I have a different cultural background, you see, from dog eating culture. So, you know, dog eat dog, man. Get it on. I was an atheist who just liked to pony. What do you mean by that? Is there uh, plenty of extremist jihadi crusader type Christians here on YouTube? Jihadi crusader? <laughs> what the heck? It's so ignorant, it's unbelievable. <laughs> but no one's bothered to really weed them out. They're kind of crept in under the radar. No one's really noticed them. Oh, Until recently, they've started to emerge, haven't they? You know the types. I think most Asian Listen, Mickey, if you don't like somebody, just go on your way, all right? What the heck, man? What the heck? Why are you taking so much, like, your business and time on them? You know, if you see some fundamental Christian that you don't like, move on. That's all, man. Why are you so buttered all the time making videos? I mean, you made like five straight up videos. I, you know, I mirrored, I mirrored your videos, right? They're like up to number seven, man. Listen, Mickey, move on, <laughs> all right? <laughs> Stop harassing people. Stop making some trolling comments or, or videos, you know? Stop making yourself stupid, okay? I don't think you're, I don't think you are that stupid. I, you know, I know how you look like. You look like very stupid person with like droopy neck and everything, with receding hair and everything. But I'm not going to judge you from outside. You know, it's okay. You can take off your uh, mask or whatever. It's okay. But thing is, you are just being too, how should I say, buttered about everything. You know, too sensitive, honey. And you need to like go out and actually date girls, all right? I might have to end this. Yours is like seven minutes, and it's really, really boring. And I'm, my video is, is quite direct, and probably people would find things a little bit entertaining than your crap. But uh, let's see. Let's go about uh, 30 seconds. I think the Thai food is almost here. And, you know, if not, then I'm just going to end it. Okay, Mickey? Yes, we call them creationists, really. And that's a bit of a broad term. I don't think that's quite correct. They are extremists, and I think they should be called... You know what, Mickey? Before you uh, accuse anybody being an extremist, extremist or whatever you want to uh, accuse, make certain intelligent videos actually refuting what so-called creationists got to say, all right? If you have certain things that goes against your education from your textbook, then compare that and then, you know, make some kind of rebuttal video. I mean, you guys make so much fun of Netflix free. Why can't you make any kind of, like, rebuttal videos or whatever? You know? I mean, what the heck? If you have certain issues, bring it up. You know, discuss it. You cannot just uh, dog on, uh, you know, people calling them fundies or creation. I mean, nothing wrong with you calling that. You have every 
freedom of speech, I guess, if you got a mouth. But, you know, you got to, if you, when you want to say, what I'm saying is when you want to say certain things, you need to back that up a little bit, all right? It's, you're not, you're not God, right? <laughs> you don't know jack crap. <laughs> you're blabbering your mouth, you know, with all these little things that you picked up on the internet, right? You don't want to sound so stupid now, do you? Extremists, fundamentalist extremists is what they are. <laughs> Um, as far as they're concerned... By the way, when you just said it, when you just said it, you sound so butthurt. <laughs> you can just die. They don't care whether you live or die. They will say... What? What the heck you mean? That's that's a lie, man. That's a lie. Listen, if I consider you as my friend, I could lay my life for you. Can you do that to your friend, man? Can you do that for your friend? Well, we want you to find Jesus and all the rest of it. As soon as you start to question any of it, they'll you know, say, well, I'm not sure about this. They will just say, well, I'm dusting my feet with you then, and I'm going to try and fuck you over somehow and tell some what? lies and twist things around to fit my own evil agenda. You know what, Mickey? When you say that again, you got to give us an example. You cannot just crap out, you know, trying to screw you or whatever. You know, the reason why you get screwed, I think, is because exactly what you're doing. You're crapping out irrelevancy, you're crapping out the things that you have no idea about without anything to back up. So obviously you're a joke, you're like internet joke. I mean, look at you man, wearing some movie masks and everything. I mean, what do you expect? <laughs> you can... See, it's very similar to extreme Islam. They don't want to admit that. They will say... Listen, if you want to bash on Islam, make Islamic Islam video. If you want to, you know, do certain things, about Christianity, just do that. If you want to do both, make sure you bring you know, certain material together. As I said, give me, you know, give me an example of a Christian blowing himself up. All right, all right. Oh yeah, yeah. No, no, we're doing the right thing. We're the real Christians. It hasn't developed as much as Islam as you've got the Shiites and the um, Jews and whatever else, all different types of. <laughs> But you do have different types of Christians. Um, I suppose you've got Catholics and Protestants and so on. Mm. They really need to be put into their own little group and categorized <laughs> and pointed at so everyone knows who they are. Labeled. Stick a label in oh, them. Well, what do you think you're doing, man? <laughs> this guy's so self contradictory and so self revealing. You know, you're like hang, hang, you know, <laughs> hitting your head on the wall. It's so believable. You're digging yourself and putting your head on the ground, man. Hold on. I think we should call them Kantians. <sighs> I like that word, Kantians. Yeah. Do you know what Kantians means? This guy. <laughs> Listen, you don't know what is good or bad. All right. You don't know what Christianity is. You don't know what Islam is. You don't know even what Fundy is. You don't even know what. Creationist is. You have no idea because you're not even educated in any of those. You know, you can't that's why you cannot make proper rebuttal. Because you are there's nothing in your head. <laughs> you know, there's nothing but what you watch on YouTube or what you have picked up on the internet. You have no substance. Duh <laughs> I think we should now call them Kantians. Then we come across one of these Fundamentalist Christians, we should just name them for what they are, Kantians, and we should all be saying... Listen, you know, if you want to incorporate those kind of words together, you got to make sure that you are educated, okay? See, that's the thing, all the things you come up with are nothing but Mickey Mouse, nothing but broken, nothing but limited, it's like six-year-old, or like juvenile, it's so juvenile, it's incredible. Why do you think that people are so entertained by you? Because you're like over 30 and you act like some like little kid in junior high school. Okay? And you don't even know that, right? And you make videos and after videos thinking that, you know, what, it's going to bother somebody? Man, you're a joke, man. <laughs> atheist and Christian and Buddhist and anyone else. You're not part of me. I've seen Christians doing this already, trying to distance themselves oh. from these lunatic extremist Christians. 
Listen, listen, Mickey. If you want to learn something, learn something. Don't just bash all together. Okay, you're making very hasty general generalization, and I believe that's a fallacy. All right. First, educate yourself first. Okay, and then maybe you can have certain, you know, proper discussion. But you cannot just like stereotype them all, and you cannot really just crap out whatever you want because you can. You know, be responsible. You know, you gotta be responsible, right? I mean, why do you think that you know that you get dumped all the time? You are not responsible. You have to be responsible, okay? Why do you think that you don't get, you have no job, and you you are looking for a job every time? You're looking for every gig every time. I mean, I could hire you like in one spot, but thing is, if I when I look at you, you are not consistent. Nothing but Mickey Mouse. You know, I mean, what do you expect from from you know? What do I expect from you? If I if I were to hire you, I mean, what can you offer me, man? Nothing. There's nothing but Mickey Mouse. Nothing. You cannot back up anything what you say. You cannot be responsible for anything what you crap out. So as a boss, why should I hire you, man? Other than just <laughs> seeing you on YouTube, <laughs> just making fool out of yourself, man. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, you know, it's 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 hard for them because they get so much shit from them, which isn't surprising, really, is it? That's oh hard. man, if you are butt hurt, just move on. All right. If you wanna just kind of get things better, then apologize for the things you're you're pulling. I mean, you pulled a lot of crap. All right. I mean, at first I just pass it by and and laugh with you, but guess what? Not cool, man. What you do is not cool. What you do to people is not cool. Do you understand that? Lunatics and extremists. Anyway, it's what I've done. I've linked two videos below, very short, to the point. One is from a regular Christian who is saying that you know how he's done things wrong and so on, how he's backstabbed and everything else, right? Oh, Christian. he's gonna have my the video. video underneath that is from an extremist sure. Christian who is living in a dream world. Okay, he's projecting his own fears, projecting all of his own hate and anger onto everyone. Hate and anger. I have nothing but love for you, Mickey. <laughs> Why would I hate you? Huh? Why would I hate you? Don't you even know? Don't you even know? I mean, when people speak to you, you know, just because you think that that uh, they're hurting you, think about what you have done. All right. I don't hate you, Mickey. I feel sorry for you because first of all you are you have to wear this mask and secondly I think you're a little nutty all right I think you've been traumatically you know affected by something when you're little and and I think you are not uh, fully a man uh, meaning you're not responsible for yourself and for you to like crap on other people when you are not even worth you know judging anybody sorry I mean I have to say it you're not even that okay then what what do you expect nobody will hear I mean nobody will listen to you they will laugh at laugh at you and laugh with you but they're not going to listen to you that's the difference all right other people so it's coming back on him he thinks other people hate and anger towards him the truth is it's his hate and anger he is pushing out there and then reading it in other people when other people don't hate him and probably couldn't care about him. So if you have a look at the two videos I've left below and just see the difference in what they're saying. And one is projecting and one That's is what's coming the, to terms. Really? One, 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 one. <laughs> this, this is moderate funding for this. This is his stock account. <laughs> hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. I, I see that you finally uh, resolved the, uh, the border issue. Remember you had a border and I told you about the resolution? Listen, Mickey, get a life, okay? Get a life. Man, when I want to be like this. Ay, ay, ay. Anyway, have a nice day. You, huh? We all wonder that, but that would be really horrible to say something like that about someone, so I would never say or even dare to. You, you just said it, man. What are you talking about? You just said it. <laughs> think something Mickey. like that about anybody. So a regular religious person just believes what they believe. They get on with everyone else. They're not assholes. They just do what they do. There's a few on YouTube. You probably see a few Christians. 
who are regular Christians. So, like those people who are not gospel, you know, gospeling to you, those people who don't really convict you, those people who kind of leave you alone and let you do your thing and kind of laugh at your comedies, and that's what you're talking about. Those kind of people you're talking about, right? Listen, kid, most of the people, uh, Bundy's, you want to call it, the reason why they're on YouTube, they're not on YouTube for entertainment like you, okay? <laughs> you, gotta, you, gotta, you gotta think outside of your little own box, okay? We are not here to entertain you. <laughs> Christian, so uh, IG, Amanda Gorilla. Um... Kill people? What do you mean kill people? Nobody kill people, man. Whether you are fundamentalist or whether you are just some religious person, you don't kill people just because you are fundy. Man, this kid is so, how should I say, um, not genuine at all. Not frank. Um, man, it's like stinky, <laughs> twisty, nothing but crap. Someone you think, oh my god, he just said that. He really just said that out loud. Well, you gotta give an example. All right, let's say someone said, you know, whatever. Then what is it? What is it that that made you ah? You know, I can't believe someone you said it. What? Some people cannot say certain things. What is that thing, man? Why wasn't he made into an abortion and stuck into a biohazard bin a long time ago? Of course. Well, man, that was not even nice, was it? I mean, you're talking about actually killing people and describing it. You are the one who really wants to kill people, aren't you? Whether you like him or not, he's just a regular Christian. He thinks he's a fundy. He's not a fundy. He's really not. He's off on a... By the way, you gotta tell us what Fundy is, alright? You just cannot say Fundy is someone who wants to kill, alright? No, no, it doesn't work that way. What is fat Fundy, alright? And what is not? And what is Christian? What is religion? I mean, as you... As much as you are, like, some movie-wearing uh, wearing silly guy, you know, nothing but a joke, but you think that you can decipher or discern certain people are what Christian or funny I mean you as an atheist wannabe <laughs> you know with some stupid movie mask on how can you even judge anybody whether he or she is some Christian or not road trip with Agent Adele that's not a fun day. what no what what fundies cannot have road trips <laughs> what kind of logic is this but fundies cannot have road trips. Man, agent of doubt is not a person or people. Maybe, you know, inventor gorilla. You in a serious way too, because I want you to be touched seriously. Oh man, look at this. Already he's not serious. You know, all these things that he craps out is nothing but serious, man. Okay, and that is the difference between a fundamentalist and a normal religious person. Wait a minute, I gotta really, really gotta hear this. Fundamental and normal religious person? I, I, I gotta hear this. Start with a normal religious person. A normal religious person is just someone who believes in God and so on. Um, <laughs> they might believe in the Bible or the Quran or whatever else. They don't take it literal. They take it for what it is. They might have their own idea of what it means. But they don't take it to the point of wanting to, I don't know, say, kill. Okay, so like a religious person is just normal. That's what you're saying. Hey, listen, Mickey, do you think God created some religion? Do you think God is religious, man? <laughs> People will project their own loathsome inadequacies upon others. The sort of thing where you look what, at... Wait a minute, did you just you say... All right, Mickey, I just got your video. Uh... I ordered some Thai food and I thought I would do this kind of, you know, good old TS style, kind of raw and spontaneous kind of thing, you know, A direct response kind of thing. So let's see what you got to say. I thought I'd do a really serious video. I thought I'd um, <laughs> touch something serious. Serious? <laughs> what? What are you going to do with something serious? There's nothing serious about you. Because <laughs> I don't, you know, I, I very rarely touch anything very seriously or very deeply. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, I feel so sad. Really? Oh no. Um, I told you you should go out for some date sometime. You know, you just I don't know what you got, what you do at home. I mean, you make a whole bunch of sock accounts, you troll people, hack out of them. I mean, you know, what the heck? So in this video, I thought I'd, I'd touch something, you know, very the, the, serious. Hopefully I can touch.